we have come to yet another night of Yakuza 0. Hoping to make some uh, good progress here. Last we left off, we were actually, uh, we had just met Goro Majima, um, who is the manager of the Grand Cabaret, apparently. And um, if I remember correctly, we had to go talk to like a couple of the girls who work here, who I think are having like some sort of fight or something. Man, we are we are snazzy looking. Look at those shoes. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I hope you're all uh all doing well. End of the week, thank goodness. We made it. Bing. Cherry vanilla. Nice. Papio! How's it going, man? Things are going pretty well. I'm glad it's Friday. How are you? We're going to talk to uh, some employees that I think are not getting along. <laughs> it looks like we have to work real hard to get up those stairs. Wait. Oh, wow. The colors got really weird there. Doing fine? Good, good, man. Hope you have a fun weekend uh, coming up. And when I say fun weekend, I hope you're doing some gaming. Here we go. All right, who's who's fighting? Hey, got a minute? Mm <clears throat> hmm. Ax, sir. Sorry about that. What can I do for you? Can you call Kanai? For me, uh, I need to talk to her. Uh, yes, sir, of course. Why is he so nervous? What's his deal spacing out on the clock? Yeah, we don't... We don't take kindly to spacing out on the clock. Hi, sir. Nice work out there tonight. You. <laughs> That's how I do. Thanks, Kanechan. So, you wanted to talk to me? He said she was locking horns with Sakurako. Hmm, where do I start? Uh, butter her up. Yeah, you're really smoking it. That's not what I meant. Um, I thought some new idol singer wandered in. <laughs> oh, you. That kind of flattery won't get anybody but paying customers anywhere, sir. <laughs> that right. Then I take it back. Ooh, cool, cool, man. Yeah, and... Enjoy. It was, it was good to see it. Uh, have fun. I've heard that game is amazing, so have a good time, man. And I uh, hope you have a good weekend too. What? So it was just flattery, huh? You, you wound me. You wound me. Oh, you wound me. I thought I'm like you wound me, like we were winding you up. Hmm? Thanks, dude. Oh, come on. You know I can't tell a lie. Here, I'll buy you dinner sometime soon. You forgive me? Really, I love you, sir. What kind of relationship does Goro have with his uh, staff here? Uh, this is idiotic. Time to get to the point. It's been a, mo been a month since you came on here, yeah? How's it going? Think you can make a real go of it at the Grand? Oh, I think so. The hall is much bigger than the last club I worked at, so it was pretty daunting at first, but I'm totally used to it now. And more and more customers are coming here specifically to see me. Yeah? That's great to hear. Not surprising from the number one gal from one of the oldest cabarets in the Kita area. Guess I was imagining things then. Hmm. What do you mean? Oh, see? The one month marks actually when I see that most girls up and leave. I was a little worried you might be getting the itch too. Oh, have no fear of that. I wouldn't dream of quitting now. The heck, Sa Sakurako's been trying to play the seniority card on me, but I don't even notice her. Yo, Shadow, what up, dude? <laughs> How's it going, man? Welcome to Friday. Welcome to the end of this week. Girl, hag, this is pretty serious. Oh my gosh. They're using words like hag. Oh, don't be like that. Sakurako's a vet here. She looks after the other girls too. Most love that about her. Try to get along, yeah? Ugh, I hate noisy types like that. And she's got a whole entourage. But whatever. Soon I'll have my own clique. And I won't have to deal with them. Oh, man. Does she even realize she's getting lectured here? Dense as a door, this one. She's even giving me a little tood. Uh, 
go more direct. Better make it loud and clear for her. Oh, we're going to be yelling here. That ain't right, Kanai John. You got to learn to read the room. Huh? Oh, she couldn't hear me. Doesn't matter how good you are at your job and how popular you get. Keep snubbing your seniors like that and you'll wake up one day with nothing but enemies here. In a broken leg. Fine by me. Not like I do this job to make friends with the other girls. Really? That's the best you can do? I'm disappointed. I doubt you'll be around here long enough to make those enemies then. Wait, what's suppo that supposed to mean? Is there a problem with my work? Nailed it. She's the competitive type, but her put her pride on the hook and she'll take the bait. Look, I ain't asking you to be friends with Sa Sakura... These names, Sakurako-chan. In fact, you two make much better rivals. Rivals? Yeah. We're not the kind that shanks the other in the back. Compete. Push each other to get better. You'll bring up all the other girls with you. Right now, you're just tripping over each other, and that makes it harder for everybody around you to step up. Customers may love a girl like that. Gal. Gal like that. Uh, but I got no use from here. The grand needs girls who are popular with the guys and the girls. The guys and the girls? Thing is, I know you could be that girl, Kanai-chan. That's the only reason I'm coming down on you a bit like this. You really think? I'm sorry, sir. I was acting like a spoiled brat. I'll work on being that girl. I'm being more considerate. Please, give me a chance. There, see? You do get it. I knew you were a keeper, kid. And now I know that your hearing's... decent. Uh, and I hope you keep helping me improve when I need it. <laughs> Doing well, got out of work early today because of the entire system was... Oh, no! Well, sucks that your system was down, but nice that you got to leave early. Uh, did you get to play some games? Playing some more Monhun? Kanai-chan. Gah, finally. Took long enough. Wait, what was that waiter's deal? Can't have him zoning on, out on me like that. Better go have a chat. I bet it's high. It's high as a kite. <laughs> nope, he's not high. He's just looking at a pole. A, a... Try that again. No, he's not high. He's just looking at a wall. That's the line. Man, why the long face? Need to use the facilities? Uh, sir, no. I, I got a letter from my little sister back home. Yeah? And what's the word? That my father's sick, unfortunately. The doc says he needs to be hospitalized, but the procedure they want to do runs 500,000 yen. But I ain't got that kind of cash. It's already here. It. You try asking the floor manager for an advance? Another emergency a while back already forced me to ask for one. I'm afraid if I ask again, I'll get canned. Especially for, his, for so much. You're talking to the manager of the place. I mean, g g <laughs> come on. Some event quests came out today. I had a fight of Furious Rajang about 12 minutes ago. My prize was layered armor that gives me a monkey that sits on my head. Worth? Yeah? No? <laughs> hey, have, have they come out with any more of the uh, sets where the, it makes you look like a character? Like, I, I got the one that makes you look like Geralt from The Witcher. I never got the one that makes you look like Dante. But have they come out with any others like that? I... I I know that the PlayStation one had Aloy from Horizon Zero Dawn, and I thought that was really cool, but it was a shame that we couldn't get it. I believe Mega Man and Ryu from Street Fighter were also exclusive to PlayStation, but I'm not entirely positive. But let me know. You in the habit of breaking mirrors, kid? Here, I'll spot you. What? But sir, I can't. Don't sweat it can always replace money. Same can't be said about people. Once they're gone, that's it. Sir, as I recall, you ain't been back home in a while, yeah? Take a few days off, too. Go visit your pops. Thank you, sir. Only thing that matters right now is keeping this place running smooth. I'll throw as much money at it as I need to. Looks like that's it for my staff troubles. It's about time I checked in on the hall. Dude, this guy's, like, super nice. Um, sir, there's a problem. What now? One of the customers is placing insane orders now that he knows he isn't paying for it. He went down the line of our top vintage wines to start, then started in our best whiskeys and brandies. He's already racked up about four million worth. Start at the priciest and work your way down the list, huh? 
Real class acts come out in times like these. Indeed. I figured we should stop him, so... Where's he at? Show me. Right this way. Nice. Nothing like that recently, but then again... Whoop. <laughs> Gag weapons, as far as you know. Aww. Hopefully they start doing things again like that. Maybe with the next ex expansion, maybe? Oh, he knows me. Oh, here we go. Are we gonna make an example of this guy too? Shonganena. <laughs> あの支配人この方は俺が相手する。お前は仕事に戻れ。はい、わかりました。あ、ボーイ、ウィゴー。参りましょう。エクゼンプルタイム。はいよ。うん、オッケー。繁盛してるじゃねえか。What's about to happen? Saga. まあ、ただで飲めるとは思ってなかったけどな。来るならちっとは行儀をしてくれんか。客が減るっちゅう。おお、そいつはすまなかったな。ついはしゃいじまったよ。Who are you? this guy? Psycho murder chicken? Sounds fun. Lord of the night. Okay, who exactly is this guy? Yo, knife, what's up, man? How you doing? やっぱりお前肩着が向いてるって自分でそうは思わねえの。アホの風誰がこんなこと好きでやるかっちゅう。それはお前今の立場のありがたみっていうのが分かってねえよ。金持ちも名誉もあるところや女だって随分寄って
どうしてそんなに極道に戻りたいのかね俺にはわからないよ。つつかさ、佐川。あんたにわかってもらう必要ない。今月の売り上げこの調子なら来月にはノルマの一億達成するでおおそりゃすごいとぼけんな達成したら島野の親父に俺が極道に戻れるよう口利きする約束忘れてへんやろなさあそんな約束したっけかなこの件で冗談は通じひんぞダメだあと5億稼ぐ<笑>そうしたら口聞いてやるよ Oh no おのれ Wow hello なんだ Did that dude just use the force? まあやれるわけないけどなそんなことしたらお前はあの暗い場所に逆戻りだそれは嫌だろうからなこれがお前の戻りたがってる世界のやり方だよヤクザがお前みたいな金づる簡単に手放すわけがないだろうどうだやっぱり仇の方がいいんじゃないか上等や5億やろうが何やろうが何ぼでも稼いだろう極道に戻るためやったら俺は何でもやったるわ Once again back in the game Hey there Marty how's it going? ああそうやそれが殺しでもどうした極道に戻れるとしたらお前は人殺せるのいや、いじわるってすまなかった。I don't know if he's really joking or not. You're doing amazing? Nice. I'm doing well now that it's Friday. <laughs> End of the week. Work weekend, anyways. Mr. Manager. Okay. Well, we just learned a little bit more of this guy's story. ここのホステスにノリコっているだろうそれがどないしたそいつ明日から別の店でやらせることにしたからん即戦力が欲しくてさノリコはここのナンバーワンなんだろうおあつらい向きかと思ってよ本人にはもう伝えてあるからこっちの方がよろしくな売り上げ落ちないように頑張るよなんせあと5億稼がなきゃなんだろう。Oh, man, マリオ、how's it going? How are you? What else do I stream? Um. Man.、Uh, mostly full playthroughs.、Uh, we do games from start to finish.、Uh, let's see. This year, what we've done like Tanganrompa 2, Tanganrompa Ultimate Despair Girls,、um, Fallout 1 and 2. Well, we haven't finished two yet, but we're playing that.、Uh, Devil May Cry.、Um, one, two, and three have been played this year.、Uh, I'm pretty much all over the place. I just don't play anything that's competitive, pretty much.、Um, if you check out my YouTube, it actually has a lot of my playlists of what we played. Oh, we just played Uncharted 3. Like, A month ago. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. I'm not sure if I'm going to take girls from other places. 
Shiny. This is how you do business. Uh, what is the one and only happened? Hey! Shut off my screen on me. Um, like Shovel Knight? I've never played Shovel Knight. It looks cool, though. I like games like that. Um, it, at least the original one, I think, looked like um, Mega Man. I used to play a lot, of, a lot of Mega Man when I was younger. Let's go poach some girls from other clubs. In particular, one. I like how we're just walking casually. <laughs> Nothing to see here, folks. Just uh, Mr. Manager walking through. I'm doing well. Um, I'm glad it's Friday. This has been a... It's been a week. It's been definitely a week. Second murder chicken is dead. That was quick. You gonna make his dinner? Mix of Castlevania and Mega Man. Yep. I've seen someone play. And I try to not watch a lot of... So, I watch a lot of streams, but I try to not pay too much attention to the ones that uh, are playing games that, I, that I've never played. And I remember I was watching someone like a year ago playing it. It it looked cool. Odyssey's in... Show, show, that. Uh, time to pay them a little visit. Go to Odyssey. Going to Assassin's Creed. Did you see that? <gasps> we outside now. This is New Kiryu City here, apparently. The one I have is a book movie about a gorilla and circus in a mall. It's based on the true story, I believe. Oh, okay. Oh. Mysterious man. Is it animated or is it live action? Yo, look at the face up there. You guys see that? Right there? Silly. It's like my face when I'm angry. Huh? You wouldn't want to see me angry. You are the master of that alehouse. The Grand, yes. It's an alehouse? <laughs> Come on. It's classier than that. It's a cabaret. Updated to baseball, so now I can kill non-tempered monsters in about five minutes by yourself? Hi. Sheesh. Yes. I'm that guy. I knew it! Even the way you walk is refined. Guarded? You have no blind spot? Despite appearances. <laughs> because of the eye patch. <laughs> Do I like Halo? I like Halo the appropriate amount, yeah. <laughs> I'm sorry, sir. Have we met? <laughs> my, name's, my name is Somotaro Komeki. Heir to a certain form of martial arts and its present master. Martial arts? Yes, but lately I felt my technique is sleep it is sleeping. It's sleeping. My edge has been dulled, so I left the lights of Tokyo in order to train. Yet even here I find this age of excess, gluttons and fools gorging on carnal pleasures. Nobody hungers anymore. It's like a live action movie, uh, it's on Disney Plus. Yeah, I I thought I'd heard it coming there, but like I, I didn't know what it was. I beat it a long time ago. Uh Reaper, I think. <laughs> I've beaten so the halos I've beaten are one two and three four I had started never finished um and then the others I just haven't gotten around to hey I knew it <laughs> then I heard talk of a launch called the grand they said it was the home of the of a most interesting man did you hear that I'm interesting part of my asking but have you visited our establishment what kind of question is that Guzzling booze with painted ladies hanging all over you. Bah! Want an excess. Of course I haven't been. Also, speaking of Halo, what what do you think about the news that they released like a week or two ago that Infinite is delayed in, into 2021? What do you think is going to happen there? And um, I haven't seen exactly why it happened, but it, it's, it's not good news. <sighs> well, then why the hell am I doing the song and dance if you ain't a customer? Besides, what's a washed up martial artist want with me? hungry air about you. It's far beyond the men I have fought in recent years. Would you do me the honor? Which honor? What, you want me to fight you? Precisely! A deeper strength sleeps within you. I refuse to let it lie dormant and unused any longer. You okay upstairs, pal? Fighting you don't earn me 
Uh, don't earn me one skinny yen's profit. I'm a busy guy. Hide behind your merchants, guys, all you like. I know money isn't what feeds that hunger. Whatever honest life you make a show of living, I can see the demon gnawing at you inside. There's only one way to appease the demon, son. Face the strong in combat and set loose those fighting instincts struggling to burst free. And you're telling me you're that strong guy? <laughs> ho, ho, ho! I think he's telling me he's Santa Claus. Uh, as it happens, I am. Now, do you see a reason to face me? Not that it will stay in uh, my hand either way. Oh, wait, but I beat Halo 1 on Legendary off off stream. It happened. It did a, a while ago. That was like, I think I even posted a, a screenshot in uh, the Discord. I did it. I did the thing. There's no talking sense to you, is there? Fine, you win. I was just thinking it'd be a, it had been a while since I really cut loose. Not here, though. Hmm. If you insist. I did! I posted the picture! I did it! I did it! <laughs> like, we come out here to fight? This is next to, uh, like, a river or something. This place should work. Somebody's backyard. Hmm, you are awfully unhesitant to, uh, in agreeing to this. I am starting to think you keep the true extent of your strength hidden away. You must have your reasons. I know I have mine. But the fist is like the sword. Leave it in its sheath to rust, and you will not be able to draw it when it is needed. Oh. Wise man say. What say you? Ever feel an urge to shrug off your restraints and fight the, to the full extent of your abilities for a change? Uh. If you're offering, I'm game. Not too big on the idea of opening up a can of, on a creaky old guy like you, though. Ho ho ho! Cast aside such worries. Even though the edge left in me should prove sufficient to handle, to handle, to handle a pup like you. Show me everything you've got. Show me what you got. <laughs> Shifty-eyed man. This shadow. Poke him in the eyes. Thug style incorporates a number of merciless attacks. One of these is the eye poke attack. Where did those people come from? What just happened there? Uh, if you land an eye poke attack, the enemy will turn their back to you in pain. Show Kameki your thug style moves. Yes, because that's how thugs fight. Poke. Oops. Come here! Oh, get poked! Get poked! Oops. I poked you in the eye with, with my foot. Uh, pull off the essence of choking. One of the special moves of the thug style is a heat action called the essence of choking. This heat action triggers when an enemy attacks you or when you circle around behind them. Show Kameki your thug style special move. Whoa, hey, haha. <laughs> hey, no, no, no. Let me. There's no room. Whoops. Oh, uh, the heat gauge. Uh, okay. No! I grabbed him! Oh my gosh. Oh, it's just... Oh, it's just press Y. Hold on. Oh, Nuki! He's still alive. It's good news because it means they will have much more time to fix what was criticized in the gameplay trailer. And remember, so the game is always... is eventually good while a rich game is a bad forever. It is? But at the same time, that thing was supposed to be a system seller. Like, that's that's my concern. And also, doesn't it concern you a little bit that this game has been worked on for like five or six years <laughs> and it's still not it's still not up to par? Like, what happened there? How are my cats doing? My cats are fantastic. I love my cats. Thank you for asking. <laughs> you should know what a monkey is because you look at one every day. And, oh my goodness, I can't believe I read that. Um, oh, what you were telling shadow that okay got it got it your training is now complete attack komeki with everything you've got everything you've got nope oh get choked dude oh that's worse than a choke i just killed an old man i'm so sorry oh my gosh that's awful <laughs> that's awful Nip! Whoa. 
Yep. Hold on. Finish him. Nope. No, get him. Man, the uh, control is a little weird. Oh, oh, he's still alive. This old man, he won't die. Even when I snap his neck. That's <laughs> okay. You're a noble dwarf. I have the beard for it at the moment. You're Gimli. Um, the COVID thing could uh, do it, but likely internal struggles in 343. Three. That's what I thought I heard. That's one of the things that I thought I heard, but I, I didn't like read into it. But yeah, I don't know. I hope it turns out good. I'm really hoping. <laughs> um, and honestly, I personally didn't think it looked too, too bad. To me, it looked like something that was an alpha, though. It it, it looked like alpha gameplay. Um, and I wonder if maybe they'll release the multiplayer first. Because the multiplayer is supposed to be... It's multiplayer. And it's supposed to run at 4K 120 FPS on a console. So that's crazy. Uh, it would be good if they could still release that, but I don't know what their plans are. Hey, Ren, how's it going? How are you feeling? How are you feeling? It's good to see you. Hmm, glad to know I still have an eye for talent. Yeah, I, I only have one eye. You will surpass me one day, I promise you that. Hey, Gramps. Just what kind of life you've, you've been living? One of unarmed combat, wagering my life on my own bare fist for the last few decades. Not that my opponents have always been so gracious. I have faced swords, firearms. And you think I'm going to get stronger? Soldier. Much. Even now, I see there's been a change in you. I spar with you and regain you the strength I once had. You spar with me again and, strength, and gain strength you've never known. Mutual benefit for us both, is it not? Uh. You're feeling pretty good. Good. I'm uh, glad that you have a date for uh, your surgery. Had some barbecue for dinner, which probably wasn't the best idea. Oh, but it tasted good, though. Tum, 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 tums. Adult, it, that's adult candy. Um... B-O-W, bow? Bow? Boo? Bow? Hmm? Is the old dude still... Oh, 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 oh. How is he still alive? I don't know. He's, he's, he's... His wisdom kept him alive somehow. <laughs> I'll be walking about the city for a while. You shall see me again when the time comes. He's just gonna be wandering. Alright, I'll be waiting. <laughs> Now, if there are no more weird old guys to interrupt me, I gotta go pluck Nozomi from the Odyssey roster. Odyssey's in Shofuchuko. Show Sofukucho. So Sofukucho, got it. Um, I could head straight there, but it wouldn't hurt to gather some intel first. Just take a lap around town and see what kind of info I can dig up on Club Odyssey for the people living in it. Um So for anyone who who doesn't know what we're doing now, apparently. Um, there's a second main character in this game. This guy's name is Goro Majima. Um, he is currently the manager of the Grand Cabaret, um, like, uh, night bar. I don't know. I don't know if it's a hotel. It looks like, kind of like a fancy hotel with a bar in it. And apparently he used to be in the Yakuza. And the reason why he's the manager of that place is because, what the heck? Is because he's, uh, being punished. By the yakuza and this guy keeps on coming around and saying like hey we need you to make more money this and that to be able to pay off your debt to become a yakuza again um but we are in a completely different um area than we were whoops when we were kiryu uh when we were kiryu we were in a place called gamurocho we are currently in sotenbori um, yeah. And the Yakuza guy that is kind of giving us a hard time, uh, oh man, told one of our girls to go start working at another one of the hotels or whatever, or clubs. That's it. That's the word I was looking for. It's a club. Um, the Grand Cabaret, which this guy is currently the manager of, is a, is a club. Um, but the guy said, oh, I took your best girl and I'm sending her over to this other place because it needs some life into it um and so we're upset we're gonna go poach um one of the girls from another club 
one of their best girdles, so um, we're playing that business game, you know? Uh, Majima sounds like a character in Danganronpa. <laughs> it does sound like the name of one. You know, I bet there was one named that, if I remember correctly. Or Hajime. I think that's what we're thinking. <gasps> it's also Christmas time. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yagusa is Byakuya in this game. Wait, this isn't Danganronpa? No, not quite. <laughs> this place looks smaller than the Grand Cabaret. This is the place. Where do you make the magic happen, Majima? Oh, I was supposed to go around and ask people. No, not yet. I was supposed to get some intel first. Um, which basically I think means just go around the city, learn, learn the city. Because we just got here. Like, we just got to go outside. Uh, we also haven't saved, like, the whole entire time, so. Okay. Um. Oh, what just happened? Buckle up, kid. Because I'm taking you for the finest, uh, to see the finest ladies this town's got to offer. My treat. Nightlife newbie. You mean it? I, uh, I always wanted to try Odyssey. I hear the chicks there are ridiculously hot. <laughs> yeah, I've been there once. Can't say it was my scene. Really? But it's super popular and all the magazines give it review rave reviews. So why is that? Well, yeah, the girls are cute and the service there is top notch. It certainly lives up to the hype. So where'd they go wrong then? It's the clientele. All the other guys there were these big shot businessmen and A-listers. Old men who could light their cigs with a wad of bills if they wanted. And the girls pick up the scent of cash like sharks. A couple of nobodies like us go in there and we'll be drowning in our sorrows as we get passed right up. <laughs> oh, that really is... Is that really how it is there? Too rich for my blood. How, ba how about the Grand then? That place any easier for fresh meat like me? Oh, the Grand's great. Fantastic, actually. That's where I was going to suggest anyway. Let's head out. Yeah, that's right. The cabaret is much better. <laughs> So, Odyssey's a class act, but it's making everyone but the rich and wrinkled steer clear. Uh, if they don't get some new blood, they'll be screwed sooner or later. Sooner or later, you're gonna hate her. Go ahead and throw your life away. What this? Video booths at Gondara. You can watch videos of a varied cast of gorgeous girls. As you meet these women out in the city under certain conditions, new video content will become available. Search every corner of a town and find your dream girl. Okay, I'm not sure if that's okay for stream. <laughs> um, I, I have no idea. Um, so we're gonna steer clear of there for now. Oh, something's wrong with that guy. <laughs> what the heck? Help! What's your problem? You got something to say? Dickwads like you drive me freaking nuts. Scram. You serious? You're gonna like, get your butt kicked up and down the street. Oh, am I now? Oh, I punched you both at the same time. Insta kill. <laughs> oh my goodness. I'm embarrassed for you. Whoa, what the heck? Oh! You know what's crazy? Super Mario jumps on stuff to, like, get coins out of it. We snap necks and money just comes out of people. <laughs> it's really weird. Uh, we're really sorry, sir. Uh, you won't see us doing it again. Yeah, we... <laughs> You shouldn't be moving either. Uh, thanks. Dang, you're tough. Here, this is a little gift from me. You got a slightly battered rainbow textile. Rainbow textile. Hmm. Oh my gosh, it's been in the hundreds for three days, uh, a few days ago, but it's going to be like in the 80s for the next two weeks. It's going to be in the 70s after that. <gasps> At least that's beautiful, but ooh, hundreds. Too hot. Too hot. How did the eye patch happen? We don't know. Um, we just met this guy not too long ago. Um... He's part of the Yakuza, but he's currently being punished by having to be the manager of this nightclub. 
Uh, I'm hoping they do tell us like why he has the the, the eye patch, but I'm pretty sure it has something to do with uh, being in the Yakuza, I would imagine. He's like to jump and get coins. <laughs> Yeah, this is a different character than the other one that we've been playing. We've been playing uh, with Kiryu. Um, this is also a different uh, town city here. This is Sotembori. Sotembori. And where Kiryu's story was taking place was Kamurocho. Um, I don't know. From the, I'm sure that Kiryu's story is not finished. It Because it was like at a climax and then all of a sudden it switched to this guy. It's interesting though. I've I've actually enjoyed the uh the uh, story in this game. I think it's cool. What's this? Oh my gosh, I can't do this. I tried playing like Japanese chess in the last stream and it was awful. I think it was called like Shoji or something like that. Oh my goodness, I have I have no idea what I was doing. At Mahjong Jambalaya you can play at tables with varying rates or participate in ranked matches matches. Mahjong? I don't know how to play Mahjong either. The tables are beginner, low rate, intermediate, medium rate, and advanced high rate. Uh, the price to play at the strength of the opponents vary depending on the table. The more skilled your opponents, the more you can win or lose. Prices to join a game at each table are 25,000 for low? 2.5 million for high? To participate in rank matches, you need to pay a $50,000 registration fee, but it's free afterwards. Reach the higher ranks to win luxurious prizes. Now you know what we have to offer at Mahjong Jambalaya. Have a good time playing Mahjong. Um, I will register, but I don't think I'm going to do this right now. I might do this off, off stream. I don't know. Welcome. How can I help you today? Um, ask about rates. Our point rates uh, based on your position at the end of the game are as follows. First gets 10,000. Okay. Ne Wait, there's negative. So you lose points? Oh my gosh, this is bad. It's a bit complicated. I prefer just watching. <laughs> there's a boss you can find in the Soul Cairn. Soul Cairn. Gauntlet Dark Legacy. I've actually played that game years ago. Years and years ago. Uh, it was fun. I played that with friends. <clears throat> What's Mahjong? It's some kind of Japanese game. That is mahogany. <laughs> that is mahogany, sir. Welcome. How can I help you today? Uh, let's come. I don't want to actually compete. I just want to buy the registration. Would you like to take part in a rank match? Rank matches are attract a lot of high level players. Cost fifty thousand to register. You pay only once, and after that, you can participate in any number of rank matches. We've prepared special prizes for reaching the high ranks. And the prize for ranking first, you simply wouldn't believe it. Oh, I don't have much money. I forgot. This is not Kiryu. Has that picked your entrance? Would you like to try for the top rank? Register. Let's do it. Sure thing. Put me on the list. That will be 50,000 yen, please. Okay, here. Paid 50,000 yen. Thank you. Uh, would you like to play a ranked match right away? No. Uh, ain't got time now. Ain't nobody got time for that. Um, as you wish. Now that you're registered, you can participate anytime. Nice. Yeah, that game's great. That game would actually be fun to get some sort of, like, remake done. I think that would actually be pretty fun. I think why I enjoyed it so much was because it was similar to um, Diablo in the style where like it was multiplayer, but only but that was like the only similarity. Other than that, it really wasn't much like like Diablo. But we had a good time with it. Yeah, most likely. Oh no! <laughs> that's that's one of those guys that will beat the money out of you. Oh, a vending machine! Is 
100,000 yen. What do we get? What do we get? Expired lunch set. Come on. Not worth. <laughs> Definitely not worth. I wonder if uh, that game is on Steam. Actually, I don't... I think the only Gauntlet game that's available through Steam is the uh, remake of Gauntlet that they had a few years ago. Um, hey, bud. Hold on. Hello. Okay. Um, we should probably health and heat health boost all right let's buy um wait nope what's the maximum it's like oh my gosh 19 whoa <sighs> man i was so hoping that it was gonna stack on top of each other <laughs> i think i just took up every spot in my inventory with health potions uh, health drink potions what is this an rpg crazy uh, okay what's this have i already been here does not sound like it hi welcome sir will you dine with us today nah I'm um, pretty sure our health is okay. She looks really sad about it. We hope you will dine with us again, sir. I didn't dine. There's no again. No again. No again. Well, Steam Steam is how you purchase games for uh, PC. Uh, it's PC digital downloads. These days, when, when you buy... Like, if you buy a PC game and it comes, like, in the mail in, like, a box and stuff, it actually just comes with a code on the inside. It's not even a disc. Oh. Don Quixote? Oh, no, it's fine. <laughs> I can look later. Welcome to Don Quixote shop. Can you show me what you have? Of course. Oh, I'm like, what's happening here? Everything is grayed out. It's because I have no room. Yeah, that's why. Okay. Thank you, come again. Good. Can we talk to your customers? Is that is that something? Hi, what are you looking at? Look at those TVs. 1988, the way of the future. I'm stuck. Oh, I can't just walk outside. <laughs> Got to press A to go outside. Okay. What'd she say? What'd you say? Um, actually, we should use the item box to send some of those health potions. I mean, health drinks. Oh, so in the item box, they, they stack. there we have five on us okay cool save do, 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 do. oh what's this there's a secret place back here oh wait this is <laughs> this is where I fought that guy Look at this, the door's open. Yo, and there's a plant! Look, it's like it, it's like Resident Evil. Will you pick up the herb? Yes. What's this? Someone left their door open, by the way. You shouldn't do that. Blackjack? Welcome to our casino, sir. You will need chips to play your games. To exchange money for chips, please speak to a dealer at any table. 
Any remaining chips are exchanged back to cash when you decide to leave the game table. I wish you the best of luck. Oh. Well, this... Oh! Roulette! No, that's not roulette. Get out of here. Tricking me like that. Neat! Never would have thought that that was, it, that that was down there. Wow. Okay. Well, now we know what that is. Uh, maybe when we get some money. Cob Coban? The Copa. Copa Caban. Who's singing over here? Whoa. Excuse me. Oh. Yo, this place is huge. Huge. Oh, gosh. No. Dude, move it. What's this? Elevator. Welcome. Let me find you a seat. No. I was not planning on staying. Uh, may I take your order? I didn't know what this was. I'm so sorry. Bye. Sorry, I'll come back later. Okay, come again soon. Oopsies. My mistake. Okay, cool. What's this? Welcome, would you like some tokiyaki? No, I like a pork bun. Hope to see you again. <laughs> Don't bet on it. Uh, excuse me. I forgot that I have to talk to these people to like become friends. Hey, you guy. Oh, I did already buy stuff. The other guy didn't want to be my friend. Hmm. What legendary drinker of you, Ryuku? Turmeric and other natural ingredients make this supplement effective against hangovers. Why would that be a thing in this game? Batteries. It's always handy to have a few spare batteries around for emergencies. Well, if you say so. Oh, wait. It did say few, so I should buy at least three. Right? Wait. I should. Yeah. Maybe it's like Dead Rising and you need battery for the camera. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Camera! Speaking of which... You know, I haven't seen a shiny in a long time. Uh, hi, what's down here? Never mind, I will never know because they won't let me go down there. Hmm. Maybe that opens up later? I love all the color. This this must be wrecking the stream, but look at all the color. Everywhere, all the lights and such. <gasps> Space Harrier? Uh, they don't want to let me play. Space Harrier, 100 yen. Do I want to play? Play! I've never played this game. I believe it was on Genesis, so I never got to play it. Need burgers. Me too! Please, thank you. I'll give it a go. All right, here we go. Playing video games within a video game. It's shop time! Here we go. Shut down. Shut down. Uh, rapid fire, shoot, select, insert credit, shoot, select, what? Let's go some more. Oh boy. Menu button. Get ready. Oh, man. Whoa. Um, 
pro probably shouldn't be happening, but this is messing with my with my eyes. Oh, you hear those drums? Oh man, sick, sick. Also, inverted vertical uh, controls. Whoa, hey. Well, I'm I'm good at this. Oh, what? I can't just go through trees? What is this? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> oh! Are you kidding me? Gameception, yeah. Whoa! Whoa! Oh my gosh. Get ready. Hacks! No! Man. My name is. What the? Hot dog? What is. Hello? Oh my gosh, you know what I just remembered? No! I hope this isn't the case, but I actually have an Xbox controller where uh, it has drift. Because uh, I, I guess it broke. Get ready. Um, hello? I don't play anymore! Yes. Um, I wonder if this is the controller. <laughs> oh, man. I just noticed because I'm like, why is that going to the left? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the one with the stick drift. Which probably explains some things, to be honest. Oh, they have Outrun at this one, too. Um... Hello, welcome to the Sega Arcade. What can I do for you? Um... Nothing. Ah, never mind. Please just ask if you need any assistance. At the last place, there was a girl who wanted to challenge me at Outrun. Guess not here. Nobody wants to fight. Nobody wants to fight. Uh... This looks like food? I don't need food. What's this giant place over here? What is this? Sounds like Japanese Madonna. Madonna! Madonna! They make excuses for casual gameplay by saying it's a good- I I swear! <laughs> Welcome, sir. Let me show you to a seat. No! They they shouldn't just assume if you walk into a place that you want to eat there, and then they sit you down, and then it gets really awkward when you're like, No, actually, I don't want to eat here. Sorry, I'll come back later. Oh, and then, and, and then they're just like, Oh, okay. We hope to see you soon, sir. Thank you very much. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a loiterer. Uh, we hope to see you again soon. <sighs> now, now, now I'm just... I'm embarrassed. I'm, a, I'm really embarrassed. I probably shouldn't be, but I am. Save! Oh, I see some dudes who want to get punched in the face right here. Oh, what? What? Dude, have you not seen me smack dudes necks? Did I did I did I just say that I snacked their necks? 
get snacked. Whoa, whoa. <gasps> no. Nice. Oh my. Wow. Okay, wow. Wait, wait, wait. No! I need a bike! Grab the bike! <laughs> That's right. Yeah, uh huh. No, no, I need to get behind you. What? Okay, no, no. Wee! <laughs> wait, no! Alright, enough, 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 enough. I look like an idiot. There we go. There we go. See, I, I know how to fight. I know how to fight. <laughs> okay. Um, this looks like another place to eat. What this? Yo, this place is bright. Daikoku Drugstore. Look at all the drugs and how bright they are. Oh, right there. There you are. Hello, what are you looking for today? Uh, Die Hard Max. Introducing the new and improved Die Hard drink. Die Hard Max delivers 3,000 milligrams of taurine to prime you for whatever you might face. Taurine must be what is in Tauriner. So this must be some sort of um, special drink for health. I will buy. I'll just buy one for now. No, dude, that wasn't done. Oh, this is what you do. It's like going to the supermarket. Yeah, I'll take two, one, one of those. I'll take two of these. I see. Okay. I got it now. I got it. Appstim. That's weird. Hmm. I wonder what that stuff is for. I wonder what that stuff is for. Alright, there's a purple place across the street. Whoa, yeah, I'm going to lose it. Watch it be some sort of restaurant. Awkwardness incoming. Shot bar stigil. Would you like to play darts? Yes! Um. Wait, I'm playing by myself? Oh no! Hideko Morita. It's been a while since we've done this. Oh my gosh. This guy's amazing. Oof. <laughs> Still amazing, though. Holy cow, dude. Uh-oh! <laughs> oh, no. Are we playing a woman? Holy cow, I'm getting rocked. Round two. Hey. Oh my gosh, beautiful. Dang it.
Oh, man. You're playing like you know what you're doing. Round three. All right. Hmm, not bad. Not bad. Ah, crap. Yo, I got a low ton. Yeah, I did a good job. Thank you. Nice to talk. Hachu! No! How is a bullseye not the highest am amount of points? I hope you enjoyed the game. By the way, is this your first time in our bar? Yes. Thought I'd try something new for a change. Huh, I see. Let me give you these. You got standard darts. They're slightly better than the run-of-the-mill house. You, you couldn't have given me those when I saw me come in. And I can keep them? But of course, I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Yeah, we're going to play right now. Yes. All right. You know, sometimes, sometimes, um, there we go. Oh, yes. Oh, <laughs> Deco, he's still hanging out here. <laughs> if I win, I'm throwing one of these at their face. I'm saying it right now. That's, that's the finishing move. Oh. <laughs> How drunk are you? Oh. <laughs> uh... <laughs> eh, not bad. Low ton. Not bad. Not bad. Nice job. Yeah, thank you. I'm assuming she said nice job. <laughs> One. <laughs> <laughs> Two. What do you expect? What happened to you <laughs> from last time? What happened? Also, what a jerk you are that you keep going for um, the 60 pointers. <laughs> there we go. Holy cow. <laughs> that was terrible. Alex, how's it going, man? Just playing some darts here. Eh. 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 I don't know if she's trying this time. I, 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 I'm not sure. Oh, what? That was... Oh, man. <laughs> okay, that's better. I'm like, am I trying to lose on purpose? Oh, goodness. She could hey. still potentially win. Nope. Not anymore. Never mind. No, it ain't gonna happen. Sit down. Sit down. I swear. S Were you half asleep? Were you half asleep? What just happened there? Man. Thank you for your business. Please come again. That's all I get? Alright. Oh, you. You, you want to play, don't you? 
I see you got a steady hand, but I'm willing to bet 100,000 yen that you can't beat me at count up. Let's just see what goes on here. Uh, now show me what you got. Show me what you've got. Oh, we got this. Here we go. Takeru Kawakami. Okay. Holy cow. <laughs> no! Ugh. Yo, this guy throws, or that first one was really fast. Oh, wow. Okay. Shibadaboo. Okay, there's one. Oh, I love that one in there. Oh my gosh, three in a row? Got me a hat trick. Wow. Honestly, they should just give me a bonus and just... You can't. 200, 200 points. <laughs> this dude gave up. <laughs> That's what just happened there. Darn. Back with Nom Noms. Mmm. Ready to share? I know that Shadow is bringing us all burgers, so... There's also that. Oh my gosh. Wrecked this guy by over 100 points. I'm not even sure if he was trying. Oh my gosh. Look at that points per round. Grilled cheese. I had grilled cheese for lunch. I love grilled cheese. So good. You won fair and square. Let's do this again, but this time we bet 400,000 yen. I'll buy the drinks too. Are you game? Yep. I'd have to bet 300,000 yen on top of my earlier winnings. Let's do it. Not you guys, just me. No burgers for you. You know, that's not kind. <laughs> Here we go. Ki <laughs> Ki <laughs> That's great. Um, here we go. So now we're a little bit tipsy. And um This is basically the same as what we did with Kiryu, except it's just in a different part of town. Or in a different town. Oh crap. Whoa, we were fine, and then all of a sudden that happened. Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh crap! <laughs> okay, I was almost like, oh my gosh, another hat trick, are you serious? Watch, and now this guy's gonna be like, <laughs> What a sucker. Uh, I had water. You can't. You can't. Never mind. <laughs> or maybe he's just that bad. <laughs> oh my gosh. This guy's a machine. Oh my gosh, again! Another 120! 
Oh my goodness. Sick. Sick. Alright. He actually put some points on the board, for real. Some real points. Um, here we go. Oh. Why does it feel like we're even more drunk now? What the dang? Trick. Holy cow, we got seven bullseyes? Wait, no, I can count. Seven bullseyes? Yeah, we got seven. I know how to count. I know how to count, chat. You don't have to worry about me. We're good. You can't. Nice to. Nice to. Beat this guy by more than 100 points, too. Holy cow. Nice. Grr. All right, one more time. Let's bet a million yen and drink. Let's do it. Oh, I see. Dang it, come on, man. It was a sure thing that I was gonna win. It was gonna be fine. Bummer. Oh, good, and I'm still drunk. Great. Hi, who are you? Hello, if you'd like to play pool, it's 800. No, no, I'd love to actually play, but I suck at it. And I'm also drunk, so that doesn't help things. I bet once you get good at pool, I bet this guy over here wants to play you. I bets. Darts is fun. Darts is fun. What else is fun too is um it, uh, the batting cages. But I think that's so far, it looks like that's only in Kiryu's part of town. All right. Ah, uh, these guys here want to fight. No, no, no. Uh, no. Whoa. Oh, no. I got stuck on the sign. Holy cow. No, grab it. Oh, no, man. Who wants it? Come on. I, I just want to snap somebody's neck. That's that's all I want. Nope. Oh! Maybe drop my sign. Oh, right there! Oh, I missed my chance! Aw, oh, man. That's alright. That's alright. Still awesome. He's some kind of monster, I sure am. Sweet. Um. Oh, what? Who are you guys? What are you guys doing down here? Yakuza. Oh. What? Nope. Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take it. Okay. That ain't right. Nope, it ain't. Um... Can I go down here? What's this? Oh 
Someone's asking for their car? Donde esta my car? Donde esta? Oops. Oop. Oop. Move. Get out the way. Get out the way. Get out the way. Hi. You want to talk? Man who likes Shoji. Hey, Sonny, if you have a spare moment, why don't you play a noble game of strategy with me? Nope. Ain't gonna happen. Hun, who are you? Eh. Hey, I'm just an old man who likes nothing more than Shoji. Whenever I have time, I come to sit here, waiting for someone to join me for a game. Ah, street Shoji player. Well, are you interested in Shoji? I'll give you some slack if you're not an experienced player. Hmm, maybe I could go for a game of Shoji. Nope. No. Uh, can't right now. Maybe some other time. Ah, well, it can't be helped. Ooh, vending machine. I got to. One million. Let's do it. It's like almost everything we have. What do we get? What do we get? Torner maximum. Wait, that that just cost me a million dollars. Yo, look at this guy. Bikers. Oh my gosh. Hold on. No, I wanted to use the bike. I wanted to use the bike, but that was still pretty cool. You need to fight Alatrion again. <laughs> Come on, you can take him down in like two hits. What the heck? <sighs> Who's this guy? Hi. You staring at me? Um. What's this? What this? Karaoke. It's a thousand yen for a song. Do I want to sing? Sing solo. All right, we sucked at this last time. This time, I do have my audio going straight into the controller, so there's no, there's no um, delay. So let's see if we do any better. I doubt I'm gonna, but let's see. I'm gonna sing my heart out. Oh, I'm so glad he's so into it. Hopefully, this guy's not tone deaf like Kiryu was. Let's see now. Um, sing. Twenty four hour Cinderella. <laughs> Hope you all enjoy this one. This one's uh, going up the shadow. Um, Oh.
<laughs> I did. That was... I don't know what to blame that on. Um, oh my gosh, that's like... Worse than last time. <laughs> um, I, I don't really know what it is that I'm doing wrong there. Tone deaf. Still tone deaf. So, here we go. Yeah, I'm good. Oh, it could also be that we're drunk again. Because that, that happened last time. I don't know. I don't know if that like throws things off. Because I could have sworn that I was like pressing the right buttons and it, it wasn't taking. Um, so that was fun, huh? That was a good time. All right, now let's go check out the Odyssey. I think we've checked out enough of the town. Um, let's go check out the Odyssey, which is what we were supposed to do in the first place. Although I think with the Yakuza games, I don't think they're meant to like rush the story. I think you're kind of meant to go around and look at everything. Odyssey, this is the place. Ready to make the magic happen, Majima? He's speaking about himself. Uh, head inside Odyssey. Let's get to work. Can't just charge in and blow my cover. Oh man, I was trying to see like, ooh, does he actually have an eye under there? Is that a fake eye patch? Or not a fake eye patch, but um, is it fake? Welcome to Odyssey. Party one? Yes. あ。すみません。ただいま満席でして。少々待っていただいても構いませんでしょうか。オッケー。構えへん。待つ。ほんますみません。そしたらこちらでお待ちください。you know, he could have let me know this before, and I would have gone around and looked at everything now. Hmm, okay. That guy's so mad. <laughs> that guy back there is so mad. Oh, God, I'm telling you. Uh, I wanted to stay up late, but my mom just wouldn't let me. Um, Wonder where Nozomi's at. Better scope things out first. Use the left stick to look around the club interior, then press the A button to observe areas of interest. This guy, right here. Oh. Ah, uh, that table's hopping. One old guy in flash clothes, a middle-aged playboy, and a kid in rags. Gotta be entertainment biz. The director, the talent, and the young one's a PA for, or some piss boy job. Three customers and only two girls? Feels off balance. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. A pair of 50-something guys. Designer suits, watches look Italian. Gotta be in finance, maybe real estate. Doesn't look like one's trying to impress the other. And they got a bottle on keep. Must be regulars. Judging from how hard they're talking to these uh, those girls up, those guys are in pretty deep. Big fish like them are what keep a place running for years. Okay. Hmm, I'm not really feeling it. The hostess, uh, the hostesses feel oddly old-fashioned like their clothes are screaming. Let's relive the college years. Maybe it's a classic look, but I say it's straight up dated. Guys their own age probably don't get anything from it, but I bet it makes the old boys club, uh, feel right at home. The fact that all the girls got the same look means it's probably club policy, not the personal taste. What? the heck? <laughs> what is this guy doing? <laughs> what the crap is that? Dude, it's like a lust machine. Is Odyssey popular with that crowd? Is there even a crowd for whatever that is? <laughs> what the heck? What's that? Um, I can't unsee that. Uh, where, where else am I supposed to be looking? I'm only interested in that. Oh. Well, here we go. Hi there. I'm Takako. 
Figures they wouldn't waste the zombie on a first timer. Still, I probably I can probably pump good intel out of this gal. Oh, this is a Bright lights! Bright lights! Okay, what's my plan of attack here? What do I ask to get info on this Zomi? Um... Ask about the hostesses here. So... あ、100人くらいおるんとちゃうかな。そんだけやめる子が多いんです。やめる。うん。Number one. Bingo! I like where this is headed. その望みっちゅう子はどんな子なんや望みさんですかうーん。ほんまはお客さんに他の子のこと話したらあんまり良くないんやけど まあ、一言で言うと真面目な人ですわ。真面目。名実ともにトップレディッチわけやな。ほんなら人気が出んのも当然やな。ああ、せやけど、この前若いお客さんが来た時は逆に全然話題についていかれへんで、めっちゃ面白かったですわ。あ、今の内緒にしてな。うちが
Okay, guess we're not gonna learn anything about Takako. Oh, hi. Yamagata? Hi. ようこそ、オデッセイ。楽しまれてますか。これはこれは山形。オデッセイの試合に自らおいでになるとは恐縮やのう。すまんの。ちょっと外してもらえるか。Honey, don't call her honey. <laughs> the animation was so weird there. <laughs> さすがはうちとタメハル店の試合人。話が早くて助かるわ。あんたの方は随分と周りくどいやないか。こそこそ忍び込んで敵情視察。それがあんたのやり方か。そないなことせんでも望みに会いたきゃ呼びますぜ。
So interesting. So basically, Majima's thing is that I I need to make as much money as quick as uh, I need to make a ton of money as quick as possible so I can get out of this manager job. That's why he's he he's not scared to give up most of his staff. It's been a hell of a day. Time to get some grub and pass the hell out. Maybe I'll hit up Sotenbori Street tonight. Not before I save. I like how this guy automatically runs. No? Oh, actually, no, he, he can go faster. But it feels like he automatically just starts running. He books it all the time. Wait, hold on. What is going... What? Hello? I need to go up there. Okay, there's, there's a bridge up here. What? You want to fight? Hooligans. Food. Oh, are, oh, are you telling me to eat because I, I need help? That's probably, that's probably a uh, good call. <laughs> you did. Woo! Stop it! All right. Get up. Not super flashy. We don't have enough money to uh, upgrade our moves yet. It's because I keep spending all my money at vending machines. But it's okay. <laughs> It'll happen for us one day. You'll see. You'll all see. That guy looks so upset. He's like, yeah, I'm the sandwich board guy. <laughs> he looks so mad. Oh. I went to school to be a doctor. Uh, you think this is a joke, pal? Menacing voice guy. What's that guy on about? Sounds pretty pissed. There's a fight going down down there? Oh, I bet it's that old man. It's the old man who wants to uh, teach us stuff, I bet. I've been trying to do the poke eye thing. Uh, but it hasn't been working. Whoa, they have weapons. What kind of clown uh, goes on a raid with a big honking sword like this, you moron. Don't don't you got any daggers or guns? You know, normal weapons? Oh, can't see the appeal of a Chinese broadsword? This is why uh, I was hesitant to insult you. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I never finished. And, um, yeah. I think I've done okay. <laughs> But uh, these days, I think it's a different story. I think these days, like, if I was trying to get a job now, just having a degree of any type helps to get any, any type of job, really. Um, you're making you're making this about me? Awful cocky for a two-bit black market front. Whole, paint, whole point of business is giving your clients what they want. Sounds like an arms deal. Seems something I want to get involved with. Oh, really? Yo, look at that guy's scar. I deal only with clients I respect. If you approve that, you are worthy of my weapons. Undergo my test. Oh. Test the hell you want about. You and I will spar. Defeat me and you pass. Getting real tired of your high and mighty talk. Fine. You want to fight? I'll take you. See how, see how you like your precious can opener when I'm <laughs> using it on you. It's the can opener. <laughs> Indeed, that's the point. 
This is a test of your proficiency with a weapon. Huh? I ain't gonna feel sorry when you lose an arm or if I straight up end you. Oh, man. Listen to that music. It's so good. Whoa. batter up who is this guy oh I just learned something what dude there was a him The hell are those moves with that stick? It's no martial art I've ever seen, but he's got the other dude's sword looking like a dang chopstick. Son of a bee! Ah, uh, you fail. Oh? Yeah? Well, what do you expect giving me a crap sword like this? That staff you got's w a way better weapon. This is merely a piece of lumber. The sword you hold, on the other hand, is a masterwork I painstakingly crafted. What? But apparently you were unfit to wield it. I would ask that you do not return to my shop again. Huh? To hell with your shop! I hope it burns with you in it. Rumor said you were the dealer to me, so I went to the bother tracking you down, and for what? You fraud. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's crying. <laughs> yep, he was crying. Um, I've just been starting. Don't want to get dragged into somebody else's dirty dealing. I'm out of here. What? No, go back. Oh, this guy again. Komeki. Ah, Majima. Curious meeting you here. Oh, it's you. Don't speak to me like that, Gramps. I was really wandering about in search of a place where the two of us could spar uninterrupted. That's so. Well, the Riverside's occupied at the moment. A real nasty customer at that. His name is Fei Hu, a local arms dealer, quite the master himself, too. So long as a weapon rests within his hands. Or, so long as a re weapon rests in his hands. What do you know? What? You know that guy? I knew his father for ages back when he walked this earth. Checking in on him was half my reason for coming to Silton Bodhi. As long as we are all here, why don't I introduce you? Hey, I didn't ask for any favors. Oh, don't be so stubborn. This will be, this will be good for the both of you. For the both of you. How do you f figure? Besides, the time to sneak off has long passed. It seems Fei Hu has been aware of your presence from the start. What? Apologies, Komeki son. But I do not trust this man. He has an air of danger about him and an eye patch. Uh, now, don't you be go being stubborn on me, too. Delay no longer and put him to the test. I can tell you already. I, yeah, I can tell you already. This young man will most certainly pass. Say what? Well, I want you to take a test. I've got no business with this guy's shop. Come, come, Majima. I saw the look on your face as soon as you bore witness to their fight. A look of inspiration. And now your silence be small even the truth. That curiosity of yours is one of the keenest tools in your armory. Yeah. Nothing fancy enough to call inspiration. Just a few dumb thoughts rattling around. Yes, but what if they were enough to match Vehu's skill? They would be less dumb, stray thoughts, and more akin to a full-blown revelation. Whether you give that revelation life or snuff it out is your choice. Care to at least give it a try? Feh. Listen, I've had a long... I've had a long day and I'm tired as a dog. Let's make this quick. I assume you have no objections, Fehu. If you re recommend him so strongly, very well. It is settled then. Now, what'll it be? The man is an arms dealer. He can, pro he can procure for you most anything you might want. Hold on, I need some water. Goodness. Hmm. Now I'm good with that beat up old bat over there. A baseball bat? Peanut butter jelly, peanut butter jelly, peanut butter jelly with a baseball bat. <laughs> this should be quite an entertaining match. Steady now. Begin! Oh man, come on. Shifty eyed man. Ah. Uh, yeah. I think I swallowed a pug or something for us. Uh, switch to slugger style, pressing it right on the D-pad. Let's switch to the Slugger style. Let's try changing to Slugger style now. 
Try mastering the strong defensive potential that a bat offers. When you guard using a weapon, you are less likely to be staggered by an attack. Use a bat to protect yourself against Feihu's vicious assault. Use Slugger Style to defeat Fei Hu and pass the test. A say what? Oh my gosh. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I certainly did not expect you to use a bet so well. You're quite the interesting fellow. Ah. Just remembered using one back when I was running raids on the competition. I think I've improved since then, though. Surprised me, too. I knew you could fight, but I did not think a spur-of-the-moment selection like that would get you far against Fei Hu. Shows what I know. So, uh, Fei Hu, right? What do you think of my bet work? Aye. Pass with flying colors, of course. You're precisely the sort of person my business exists to serve. Weapons shop. You mean... That's nice of you to offer, but as you've seen, I ain't really interested in the conventional stuff. Huh. So much the better. I'm not a common dealer of pawning off weapons I've scavenged. Well, that's cryptic. What do you mean? Are you free at the moment? <laughs> Poor dude. He's okay. He's fine. He wants to sell his stuff now. Uh, are you free at the moment? My shop is quite close. I would enjoy the chance to escort you there and explain exactly what it is that we... What it is we do. We, you say? We... Hi. This is our shop, the Dragon and Tiger. Outwardly, a Chinese restaurant operated by myself and my wife. Yeah? This is my wife, Long Hua. Mm. New customer, yes? Many happy returns. And you said it wasn't your average weapon store. What exactly is it then? Hi. Uh, most of the products we sell here are meticulously hand forged by me. Bespoke arms, you might call them. Made to order, huh? So you ain't no, so we ain't an arms trader. You're a smith, is what you're saying. Ah. Precisely. Now, if I may, I would like to explain how it is I go about making weapons. At the Dragon and Tiger, you can enlist a host of agents to locate weapons, gear, and other equipment. They can be hired to hunt down the following three categories: gear, recipes, and parts. Put the agent's skills to use and gather the world's most powerful weaponry and equipment at your fingertips. So you send these agents around the globe looking for rare materials and such? That is pretty different. Our goal in all of this is, de is to develop a robust network with arms dealers the world over. But some agents work tails... Wait. Some agents work takes them far from civilization. So basically, you got these guys searching for treasure out in the jungle and stuff. Um, I'm all about that, actually. Oh, really? Is that for real? Uh, indeed, remote archaeological sites produce some of the most be beautifully wrought and historically important weaponry. My shop is always on the lookout for such gems. Furthermore, customers whose contributions pass a certain level are given a special reward, private arms lessons. Yeah? So I'm guessing that means that you weren't holding back when we were fighting it, and when we fought out there? Naturally. That was only a test. Huh, you're only one slippery eel. Aha, uh -huh. speaking of fish, I just remembered I ain't ate yet. Uh, I'm half starved to death here. You said this place is a Chinese spot by the day? Yeah? Give me the, sp the house special, would you? Uh, yeah. You customer for that side of... Wait. You customer for that side of business, too? Oh, you customer for that side of business, too? You wait. I fix you a feast. Yo, I'm not... Uh, My health is full again. Nice. Sweet. Who's he? Um, Fei Hu. He is a smith of sorts. He's going to make us weapons. Majima, there's a favor I would ask of you. But now, I don't need to tell you not to spread the word of uh, their business, but I'd also like to ask you to keep vigil over them. Why is that? A happy couple in some kind of trouble? I cannot share the details now, but in time, their shop may draw the ire of a terrible... <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> of a terrible foe. What's that supposed to mean? 
Nothing to worry yourself over just yet. I ask only that you drop by when you think of it. Perhaps buy something? Send them out on a search, that sort of thing. Okay. Okay. Yeah, he's he's like a weaponsmith, but not like regular weapons. Yeah, alright. A minute into the wilderness to train. Don't go letting that edge of yours dull either. Thank you. I didn't sneeze, but... Um, I think it's because of all the reading that I've had to do tonight. And then I was actually on the phone and stuff today. <clears throat> that my uh, voice is starting to... Uh, get tired. Which is good because I, I was planning on ending stream at about 10. So huh? it's kind of getting to that point. Hey, who? We've run out of eggs again. You're supposed to be out shopping. Oh. Oh, sorry. Weapons customer stopped me to complain, and I guess I got distracted. Good. You guys seem busy. Want me to come back later? Yeah. Oh, Majima-san, how are you? I'm sorry you had to see that. <laughs> Hello, Majima-san. Anyway, back to eggs. Fei-hu, best prices at market town at, at a market next town over. <sighs> uh, you're relentless, all right. I'll be back with them soon. <gasps> oh, while you're there, you can look for equipment for Majima-san, too. Yeah. What? But I've never done agent work. Uh -huh. You want Feihu to do what? We told you about agents, like treasure hunters, but find equipment and parts. Feihu, go find things for Majima-san. Make lots of money. <sighs> is this work really such good money? What do you do exactly? <clears throat> this is what we do, Ma Majima-san. Oh, man. Select a destination. Costs and obtainable items vary by region. What? Okay, Hercules Sporting Goods. Dispatch agents to locations in Japan. Expenses are lower when compared to dispatching overseas. Okay. Hercules Sporting Goods. Just a regular sporting goods shop. Sells baseball bats and golf clubs. Okay. Uh. Okay, so there's two pages. Guaranteed find. Steal 100. Lucky find. I'll also find a dagger. Equipment rate. Metal bat. Parts rate, plastic, iron, lead ingot, what? A weapon craftsman who's much happier in his workshop, but is sometimes forced by his wife to take on assignments as weapons agent uses a large travel bag. Okay. What the? Oh, that's how fast I want him to get it done. Okay. If I want him to get back sooner, I can pay. I see. We treasure hunters now. Actually, it looks like we're just... We send out people. We don't even do it ourselves. <laughs> okay, search request done. Next time you choose agent and destination to search. Oh, and don't forget, you can pay a little extra too. <laughs> extra funds motivate agents. Get better things and also come back sooner. Uh. A little tip to get... Uh, to get them to work harder. Eh, makes sense. All right, good luck, Fehu. Hi. Thank you. I'll do my best. I'll contact you on your pager when I return so you can come pick up what I find. Langhua? Uh, make sure to lock the door when I'm out. I'll be going now. You're dispatch you've dispatched an agent. You have dispatched an agent. Uh, to see how long the search will take, press start and highlight equipment in the pause menu. You cannot dispatch another agent until the first one returns. When enough time passes, you will receive a notification on your pager to return to the Dragon and Tiger. Okay. Crouching dog. Uh, can I go upstairs? No. Hello. Fehu not back yet? <laughs> okay. She just sits there. There's there's no one who comes to eat at their restaurant. I feel so bad. Oh, uh, their food must be okay, at the very least. I liked it. Gave me back my health. There's an old woman in there. You see that? What? Why is this guy looking at me? It looks like he's talking to me, but no words are coming out of his mouth. Oh, hello. Ai Uyuhara. We hadn't got one of those in a while.
Hi, what are you doing? Hello. Hey, buddy. He's a card collector. I'm a telephone card collector. Got any cards I could see? I just want to take a look. That's all. I might have some. You only want to look, bro. Ah. I used to collect them myself, but after I see a card for the first time, I just kind of lose all interest in it. That's why I don't mind just admiring someone else's collection. That makes you a pretty odd collector, don't it? Why don't you just drop the hobby? No, I can't give it up. I couldn't go on living without reveling in telephone card collections. I need them. Teach his own. Fine, I don't miss showing... I don't mind showing you my cards. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, don't bother with incomplete sets, though. Yeah? Incomplete sets. Only full three-card sets really do it for me. There's three-card sets? You know how cards got A, B, and C on them? It's because there's three different cards for each girl. When you complete a set, come and show me. You're a picky guy, ain't ya? But fine, I'll swing by and show you if I end up with a set. Okay. How many of these cards are there? I think I've only found, like, four. Ooh! Vending machine. Mega Drive stuff toy. Ooh, cool. Nice. This guy looks like he wants to talk. Who said that? Aw, oh, man. Aha! <laughs> Who knows? Oh, batter up, dude. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> that is good. Oh my goodness. Dude, I can feel it when you hit him. Pizzani. Pizza and spaghetti. How about some spaghetti? No, <laughs> there's that guy at the sandwich board. Whoop. Sorry. Hmm. What's that girl doing by herself? She lost sub stories. The doll girl. What are you doing? Hey, kiddo. Where's your mom? Are you lost? No, I'm not. No? Then what are you standing around for all by yourself then, huh? No reason. What's with this kid? She's doing it, uh, she's doing it right not talking to strangers, but it's dangerous here. Better send her back in. Listen, why don't you hightail it back to your mom instead of loafing around here? This ain't no place for kids. Okay, off with you then, you little scamp. Kind of looked like she had something to say. Still, she ain't lost and ought to make it home okay. Just hope there's no troublemakers lurking about. Hmm, this is my pager. Uh, make dragon, tiger, and equipment. Something must have come in. Okay. Looks like Fehu's back from that equipment search. Wonder what he found. Gotta swing by the dragon and tiger. It's a good thing that it's right next door. Oh, look, another card. Another phone card. Are you kidding me? This is crazy. There's another one right here. Kotomi Asakura. Kid, I'll come talk to you in a minute, okay? Uh, there you go. We got equipment search results. Visited an old rundown shopping district near Sultan Bodhi. Managed to sneak into the store despite suspicious looks from the shoppers. It's too spicy! Treated to a hellishly hot meal. Success! Mission went reasonably well. What? You got a dagger? And a recipe for a metal bat. Parts obtained, steel. Uh, did he get both steel and iron? Or only steel, because there's a little thing next to it. Uh, I don't know what that means. Here you can receive the equipment item recipes.
parts or assets found by your agent. Equipment is immediately ready for use. Recipes enable you to craft equipment, provided you have all the necessary parts and enough money to pay for the fee. If the name of an item is not shown in the crafting menu, it means you have not yet discovered the parts or equipment required to make it. Dispatch agents to various locations to obtain many different types of parts. Once you obtain a new piece of equipment, it also becomes available for purchase in the shop. Crafting it will be cheaper than buying. Mm. Equipment, recipe, parts. Not bad, Fehu, not bad. I'm not a professional agent, but next time we will call on one of the agents in our network. We'll continue looking for more agents as well. I hope to expand our network to get better information on powerful equipment and and acquire more resourceful agents. As you might imagine, the more valuable the equipment, the harder it is to get it. Ugh. Makes sense, I guess. If you got a one-of-a-kind weapon, you ain't gonna want to sell it to some agent guy. In those cases, the agents can bring back recipes with information on how to create a replica. I can then re recreate the item in my workshop. We need parts for that. So get parts. We have some spare ones here. You can have them for free, you lucky man. We got lit ingots. And quality iron. Iron gears. Timber. Driftwood. Cursed handcuffs. What? Flint stones. Flint stones. Uh, you can find parts at regular shops too. Look around in Sofococho. Uh, you bring parts, we make equipment. You bring money too. Otherwise, we don't eat. <laughs> I can craft or sell you more of any equipment you already obtained in the past. Getting just a recipe without ever having the item made doesn't count, though. Ah. Got it. I send agents off to find recipes and parts for you to make me awesome weapons and protective gear. Sounds good. I gotta start saving up so I can afford all that. Mm. Wait, Fei Hu, eggs. Where are eggs? Oh, I'm sorry. I was so busy with the equipment search that I forgot all about shopping again. <sighs> Mm, Majima san, it will, it will take some time to get to make preparations for a more substantial equipment search. Ah. Sure, take your time. I'll find something to do and come back later. Good luck with the prep. Whew, goodness. So much reading. So the little girl. Yep, the little girl's still over there. wonder if, how Fei Hu and Long Hua are doing. I'll drop in to see him later. We just left. We just we just left there. Why are we wondering how they're doing? We just left. Nani? It's okay. Hey, who's training? Uh, once you become more familiar with weapons, Majima san, I will teach you new ways to build them. Yeah. That really gonna be necessary? Ain't gotta be a genius to work out which way is the pointy end. Yeah. <laughs> Consider it part of my service. It would be a shame to leave the full power of the weapons you obtain from me untapped. Uh -huh. Just saying, I got my own way of doing things, but hey, if you if you'll go through the trouble, I'll hear you out. I would also recommend that you work at honing your bat skills. There is a wealth of hidden potential there. Mm. Think so? I don't know. I kind of figured bat meets head was pretty much the extent of it. Yeah. No, you have much more to learn. By my estimation, your bat technique could prove more deadly than even swordplay if you develop it. More deadly than a sword? Are you serious? So this. Quite. The bat and the katana are alike in length. They say some baseball players purchase a katana and practice their swings with them to heighten their focus. But considered as another class of weapon, the bat's weight resting at the far tip yields exceptional destructive power, making it distinctly different from a blade. <sighs> yeah, they're obviously two different things, but the principle's not so far off, right? Yeah. I'm telling you, there are techniques you could perform with a bat that simply wouldn't be possible using other weapons. I, should su I suggest you work on uncovering these. <laughs> Make him a big deal out of this, but a bat's a bat, if you ask me. Just whack people with him. <laughs> this is a truly groundbreaking technique. I will teach you new weapon skills as you progress, but I ask that you show me your bat fighting skills in return. I'll show you anything you want, but I ain't exactly the professor type. Yeah. Hey, I got an idea. What is that? When you teach me new weapon moves, how about you take me on with that weapon? I'll fight back with a bat. Mm. It would be difficult for you to pick up new techniques that way, I fear. I believe it is better to begin by learning the proper stance and forms. What? You're going to make a pro baller start by playing catch? We ain't exactly amateurs here. I'd rather get a feel for a weapon naturally in a fight. I see. I suppose that method may be better suited to you. <laughs> I've been looking forward to going another round with you anyway. <laughs> this should be fun. <laughs> Perhaps that is your true motive. Well, I will be here when you are ready to continue your training. Nice. Sub story over. Hello, what do you need? 
Um, let's uh, craft. I'd like you to make something for me. This is an ordinary piece of wood you might find anywhere. Its durability is low, but a hit can still cause a decent amount of damage. Uh, this is an ordinary pipe. It's lightweight, makes it easy to handle, and it still packs a considerable punch. Butterfly knife. Uh, this folding knife lacks offensive potential, but it is very portable. Potent portables. What you want? Wait. Arigatou gozaimashita. We're fun. I mean, fun. Yeah, we're fun. I mean, fine. Mm. You haven't trained enough with your bat yet, Majima-san. To learn more weapon techniques from Fei Hu, you must upgrade your slugger style abilities under abilities in the pause menu. Look forward to seeing the results from training. The problem is, is that I keep spending my money on other things. So I don't have any money to upgrade my attacks, my abilities, so they say. All right. Oh, hey, sorry, didn't see you there. Whoa. Check it out, little kid, all by her lonesome. She ain't old enough to hustle. Keep your eyes peeled, would you? <sighs> no, fool. Grab the kid, shake down the parents. Easy come, easy go. Pretty smart. Could be some nice cash in that. Let's do it. No, don't do it. Don't. Here we go. Got something real nice for you, little girl. Come over here. Don't wanna. Huh? Little brat. Come in one way or the other. No, leave me alone. See? What did I tell you? Ugh. Who the hell are you, her old man? Nobody special. Just looking out for a stranger. Huh? Stranger? Then mind your own business. Don't go getting any ideas or we'll make sure you regret it. Next time you're out... Uh, next time you ought to take my advice and head straight home, kiddo. This is a dangerous town full of scumbags. Uh, scumbags? Nobody calls me scum! Menacing man. There's actually two of them there. It's men. Oh, no! Whoa! Oh my gosh! You want you want some of this too? Get up! <laughs> That's insane! Oh my gosh! Look, we're sorry. Give me a break. Give me a break. Give me a break. Good for nothing losers. Uh, thanks, sir. Sir, I'm only 24, you know. Oh, we're, oh, we're only 24. Uh, anyways, I was saying, why don't you head home? Uh, okay, something wrong? You and your mom fighting? Uh, no, then what's up? The doll. Huh? The red chestnut, the squirrel. Chestnut, the squirrel? You mean the red squirrel prize in the UFO catcher? Uh, yeah. You want that? Uh, yeah. I'm sure your dad will buy you one <laughs> if you ask nice. What? Don't have a dad. Oh, no. Sorry, uh, scamp. Uh, it's okay. I'm fine. Still no point hanging around here. You can get it yourself, can you? It's okay. I don't need it, but it's so cute. I just like to look at it. Uh, yeah, you're a strange kid. <laughs> All right. I got to get going. Okay. Friendship with the doll girl. You got you got to know the doll girl. Interacting with her will gradually fill the friendship gauge. You can check the status of this gauge at any time in the pause menu's completion list. Build your friendship with her and see what happens. I've read Chestnut squir the Squirrel doll, huh? Can't have her standing around here all day. Um, if I can grab one, maybe I'll give it to her. Yep. Let's do it. Oh, no. It's one of these things. Oh, shoot. Aw, oh, man, really? What the heck is it? Uh... Yo, change, change out the prizes.
All right, let's see if you'll um if you'll put that squirrel in there. I don't. Hi, what's going on? Have a good time. That's it. Uh, that didn't change crap, sir. Do it again. Do it again. Do it, do it. Okay. Oh, right there, right there, right? Okay, camera, seriously, come on. She says she wants one of the red ones, or it doesn't matter what kind. How much is this? Get it, get it. No! Oh no! This little girl's gonna be so disappointed! Gosh, we had that. We had it. No, no. Oh, my. <laughs> Dude, I don't even know how this is a game. This, this isn't a game. Can I be bad at it? No. <laughs> oh, what? Yes, it's like Shadow said, it's Gameception. <laughs> look at the smug look on that... On that squirrel, the, the one with the blue hat. This is the one. This is the one. Hold on to that! Oh, no! Oh, my gosh! Someone bumped the machine! Going to this one. Screw you, squirrel. Oh, you stupid oh, 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 we got it! We got it! Oh! First try! <laughs> it looks pink on my screen, but we'll take it. It's red. It's red. Oh, man, I can get more than one prize? I want the blue one. To I need to complete the set. Oh, here we go. Woo! Oh! 
boing, boing, boing. Okay. Well, we got it though. We did it. We're gonna make her so happy. <laughs> it took you that long? Wow. What? You still staring at that chestnut the squirrel doll? Huh? Yeah, I am. I have one of those red chestnut squirrel dolls. Maybe I'll just keep it for myself. Give it to her. Bah, fine. <laughs> why? Why? Why do we seem so mad about it? What, what do we want the doll for? Hand it over the chestnut the squirrel red. Wow, it's red chestnut squirrel girl. Uh, yeah. Well, it ain't exactly my thing, so why don't you keep it? Really? Thanks, sir. I never got a present from anyone besides my mom before. Best day ever! That's so? Oh, glad you like it. Now, will you get on home? <sighs> yeah, yeah. I'm gonna tell my mom all about it, thanks. <laughs> this stranger gave me this doll that I wanted. <laughs> he had an eye patch. I think he was a pirate. Uh, boy, the little scamp's a handful. But it feels kind of nice to make up her birthday, or her day like that. Her birthday, I bet it was her birthday. I bet. Cool. L. Yeah. Whoa. Ooh. Whoops. I knocked her down. Oops. Sorry. Sorry. What? Flustered young woman. Hmm. What am I going to do? Oh, what am, What to do? She actually looks like she's not worried at all. Um, you! Excuse me? Huh. Um, well, the thing is, you want something from me, don't you? Let's hear it then. Yes, what I'm trying to say is, um, listen, whatever you're chewing, I can take it. Spit it out. I have a favor to ask. Can you please be my boyfriend? Okay. Niete? <laughs> Am I hearing you right? I said, please be my boyfriend. Please? Pretty please? What, just like that? Your boyfriend? You mean like you want to be a couple? Go on dates? What the hell? Yes, that's exactly it. That's what a boyfriend does. You would be my one and only boyfriend? Right. Okay. Back it up a step or six. What the heck's with this little lady here? Just run up to me on the street demanding that I be her man. Every girl I meet these days makes me understand I'm less and less. <clears throat> gotta get it together. Can't let her know she's got on she got under my skin under my skin. I'll give her a strong answer like, don't even think you've won, little lady. Um Uh <laughs> Sorry, darling. I got no interest in women. Huh? Oh, okay, I mean that's not a problem at all, but if you don't mind, could you set aside your preferences and just be my boyfriend for today? What are you talking about, girly? Oh, darn it. I've left out a few details, haven't I? I should clarify. I guess I need you to pretend to be my boyfriend, not actually be my boyfriend. Excuse me? Pretend? Hi. Yes. You see, my father is vis visiting from back home, and he's demanding to meet my boyfriend. For several years now, he's been hounding me to meet suitors he's arranged for me. He was getting so persistent that I finally got fed up, and I told him, I already have a boyfriend, so back off. I also told him my boyfriend is thin, wears an eye patch, a cool ponytail, and has a dangerous air about him. Kind of like the blade of a knife. What? Ex That's how you described your boyfriend? Your fake boyfriend? Wow. <laughs> Why would you give him so many details <laughs> to just describe me down to the buttons? I never thought I'd have to introduce him to my father, so I just kind of made it up as I went. But then Dad started saying, I have to see if this boyfriend is worthy of marrying you. So here I am, and I've got a big problem. Okay, I get the picture now. If I fit the bill, so you want me to act like I'm your man in front of your dad. Wow, you catch on fast. That's pretty much it. If Dad finds out I really don't have a boyfriend, he'll force me into an arranged marriage with some strange man I don't even know. Please! Nobody else looks anything like you. Could you be my boyfriend for just a little while? <laughs> the girl's in a pickle, all right. Who'd want to marry some guy they don't even know and end up spending the rest of their life with him? Fine. He painted himself into this corner, but I feel your pain. I'll pretend to be your boyfriend. 
<laughs> yeah, right? Yes, I'm so glad I didn't lose hope. So weird. Oh, my name is Kokoa. Please call me Koko-chan. Oh, and sorry, I didn't catch your name. I'm Goro Majima. I see, then Majima-san. I will address you as Goro-chan. Goro-chan? We just met. That's taking things a little fast, don't you think? No, no, I know it's just pretend, but we are in a romantic relationship. We can't be so formal with each other. We have to make this believable. Um, if you say so. Yes, I do. Well, let's not waste any more time. We should get, uh, we should be going, like, right now. Huh, I'm getting exhausted already. What's this about going, going where? Come on, try to keep up. We're going to the restaurant where we'll meet with my dad over dinner, the three of us. What? Right now? I've got nothing to say to your dad, Coco-chan. Make it so we meet, shake hands, and then let me go. Why don't you bing? Oh, why don't you bing, bang, boom? Oh no, that work, won't work at all. Dad won't be re reassured unless I show him what kind of a man my boyfriend is. You have to go now, Goro-chan. Gonna move on. Ugh. I don't know what I was expecting, but here we are. Here we are. No, I need to save the game. Oh boy. Are we at a McDonald's? So go to town. This is where we'll meet my father. I only have two requests. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending to be my boyfriend and don't anger him. You got it, but what's all this about making him angry? Your dad get pissed off easily? Oh no, he's just stubborn. He's not scary though. He seems to think I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed and he babies me more than he should. But underneath it all, he's as good, fa he's as good a father as I could ask for. Well, I suppose it's tough to blame the guy. If I had a daughter like you, I'd be pretty worried too. You see. So if you start seeing a bunch of weird stuff, he'll blow his lid and be all like, Forget this guy, I'll arrange your next date, so let's avoid that. No problemo. So, let's go over my boyfriend's backstory now. Excuse me? I need a backstory? We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies, and your favorite food is the omelette rice I make. Okay. Uh, what was all that now? I had to give my dad some details about my boyfriend, so I made stuff up. If he gets curious, can you make sure you've got it memorized? Well, you ain't exactly making this a walk in the park. Am I supposed to remember all these details? <laughs> Fine, from the top. We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist. You like going out on drives and watching movies, and you love omelet rice I make, okay? Bah! <laughs> I'll give it my best shot. Oh, man. This is her dad. There he is, dad, over here. This dude looks like not much older than I am. So this is Coco chans dad. Unlike, unlike his space case of a daughter, he seems pretty buttoned up. Koro chan this is my father. Hello, I'm Kokoa's father. Pleased to meet you. And this is the man I'm seeing, Koro Uh, you know, now that I think about it, meeting a girl's dad for the first time is super important for a normal couple. This could end up making an impact on the rest of her life. Guess I'd better buckle down and get into this world properly. No different than at the Grand, right? First impression's key. What do I open with? Um, <laughs> I'm delighted to meet you, father. <laughs> Please make my miso soup every morning. <laughs> Please to meet you. I'm Goro Majima. <laughs> this is going to be on the test. Oh, boy. Please to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. Majima-kun, was it? I understand my daughter looks to you uh, for a lot of support. Support? Oh, no. In fact, it's quite the opposite. Kokoa-san has stood by me at every turn. Well, how courteous of you. Something that gets to me these days is the erosion of courtesy in today's youth. So many can't e even man uh, manage a proper introduction. You seem different, Ma Majima-kun. That's right, Dad. Goro-chan's not like the stereotyp stereotypical men. Good. First impression went well. Playing the respectable type was a pretty slick move. Whew. Majima-kun, I must say I'm surprised. You really do exist. I beg your pardon? Well, my daughter described you as a man who is tall yet slender waisted, sports an eye patch, has long hair tied back, and emits a deadly aura not unlike a dagger's edge. I never imagined such a man could actually exist. Yeah, here you are in the flesh. See, Dad? I told you I wasn't lying. My boyfriend's right here in front of you. Yes, I figured he was another figment of your overactive imagination, so I'm really quite shocked. Huh? Overactive imagination? Dad, don't... I don't make things up that often, do I? <laughs> uh, well, they do seem to be on good terms, and her dad's a decent guy, too. Stern, but decent. Oh, yes, Majima-kun. Kokoa may have mentioned it already, but what line of work are you in again? 
My job? Oh man, I think Akua mentioned that in the backstory she gave me. I manage a cabaret. I'm a Yakuza! I don't want to ruin things for her. I'm a dentist. A dentist? Oh yes, yes, that's right. I heard you're a dentist. I never would have guessed from your appearance. Not the face I'd expect from a dentist at all, to be frank. I get told that often, yes. Oh, Dad, you're being so rude to my Goro-chan. I'm just glad I remembered that Goro-chan told me uh, in that hack job of a, of a backstory. Incidentally, Maji Majima-kun. Yes? I was wondering, how did you come to meet Kokoa? Oh, well, that's, uh, I didn't ask you. I asked Majima-kun. But tell me, Majima-kun, how did you get to know each other? What the? Uh, he's prying pretty deep. Is he on to us? That explain how I supposedly met Coco Chan in a way that will make him s more suspicious. Um, we sat next to each other at a movie. Cause I love movies. Um, he happened to sit next to. Wait, we happened to to sit next to each other. We happened to sit next to each other at a movie theater. That's how we met. At a movie. Come to think of it, Kokoa did mention that you enjoy movies. Yes, like I said, Koko-chan just happened to sit next to me. The flick was a real tearjerker, so I offered her my handkerchief, and the rest is history. Yes, that's how it went. Amazing, Koro-chan. I can't believe you came up with such a... I mean, remember it like it was 15 minutes ago. It was so romantic. <laughs> well, what a fortuitous meeting, then. I'm just glad she didn't meet her boyfriend at any places she shouldn't be. Of course not. My Koro-chan is a proper and decent man. There. I went in Koko chan's backstory and came up with a tale that rings true enough. Majima kun, I'm going to put you put it to you straight. What is it about my daughter that you find attractive? Oh man. Dad, why would you put him on the spot like that? I'm sorry, Kokoa, but I'm just so worried about you. You're still so innocent, like a child. It keeps me awake at night worrying about whether or not you'll ever manage to live a proper and prosperous family life. If there's a man who would love and treat you well, why? I would give him my I would give you my blessing for a marriage right this instant. Dad, uh that's why I need to ask Majima kun. What about Kokoa? What about Kokoa do you find attractive? He's looking into my soul here. <laughs> I can't play with his daughter's features on the line. Uh, I don't like tricking him, but I told Koko chan I'd go along with this. Gotta find a good reason why I find her so attractive. She's so cute! She makes great omelet rice. Oh, that's it! fell in love with how great the omelette rice she makes is. Oh, I must agree with you there. Her omelette rice has a special quality to it. I love it too. But, but Majima Kun, if that's all you see in my daughter, I don't want to give her away to you. If it's delicious omelette rice you, rice you want, you just as easily marry a cook. Dad. Man, tapping into Koko chans backstory backfired. From her dad's point of view, he'd want a guy who appreciates his daughter fully, not just for her cooking ability. Huh? Oh, would you two excuse me? I need to go wash up. Uh, sure, honey. Don't fall in. <laughs> oh, <hey. laughs> Wait a sec. With her, power, with her powder in her nose, it sounds just me and her old man. Ugh, oh, awkward. Majima kun? Yes? I have no idea who you really are, but thank you for playing along with my daughter's lie. Huh? Her lie? What lie? <laughs> I got no idea what you mean. What well, lie? <laughs> you can stop pretending. I knew this was all an act from the moment I sat down. Was it that obvious? If you knew from the start what gave us away. I could tell just by the way my daughter was acting. I wasn't her father for all these years for nothing. Then why'd you go along with this dumb charade for so long? Mm. Kako is so desperate to convince me. It's my fault she tried to stunt like this, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I kept pushing her into dates with all those suitors I'd arranged for her. You know your daughter well. You saw right through her. I lost my wife and Kokoa was still an infant. I raised her alone without anyone else's help. I tried to raise her well, so no one would look down on her for not having a mother. But I know I've been overly protective of her. I can see now that she's capable of standing on her own two feet. I've got to stop telling my daughter what to do, uh, to do this or that. No more pushing her to meet potential suitors. She's her own woman. It's time I learned to let go. But the truth is, there's another reason I went along with a little charade. What's that? Someday my daughter's going to bring a real boyfriend to, uh, to meet me. And I thought this might be a good practice. Practice, huh? Thanks to you, I got a good idea of what to expect. When the time comes, I think I'll manage. Bah! 
still ain't a good feeling to spend so much time lying to someone who knew it from the start. But I gotta tell you, I think avoiding an arranged marriage wasn't the only reason Coco Chan pulled this stunt. What do you mean? I think she was trying to show you that you don't need to worry about her so much. Worry? Yeah. Pretty plain to see that she's the source of a bundle of your worries. I think she wanted to reassure you that she's capable of looking at her, uh, after herself. She wanted to prove to you she can manage her own affairs, like getting married. Coco chan! Sorry, I'm back. <laughs> the way I read that, it's like, sorry, I'm back. Like, oh crap. I'm sorry I had to come back. Sorry, I'm back. Um, I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. Did you even break the silence? Welcome back, Okuchan. So listen, your dad actually knew. Majima kun? Yes. Goko? You've done well finding this man. I had nothing to do to worry about after all. Dad? I know, right? Goro-chan's a super guy. So this means he'll stop trying to set me up, right? Yes. I can see there's no longer any need. Really? Awesome! It's been an awfully long day. I'm heading back to my hotel. Oh, okay. I'll walk you back, Dad. We had a girlfriend for 10 minutes. Goro-chan, thank you so much for being my boyfriend for even just a few minutes today. It was 10. Goro-chan, I think you did an excellent job pretending to be my boyfriend. <laughs> That's more like it. Glad to hear it. I wanted to give you this. Thank you. You got five pieces of fluorite. Whatever the case, I think I'm free from dad hounding me to meet his suitors. What a relief. That's good. Yes. Well, I have to walk to, uh, to walk my dad to his hotel. Ah. Yep. When you get a real boyfriend, you better do a proper in introduction so he doesn't have to worry about you. Hi. I'll try. Bye now. <laughs> and this is where we got engaged without even knowing it. Koko, I forgot something. Give me just a moment. Uh. Oh, okay. Huh? huh? Something wrong? Majima kun? There's one last thing I need to say. Huh? Eh? What's that? Majima kun? I'm glad I got to talk to you. You went through all the bother of pretending to be my daughter's boyfriend just for my sake. You're a good man. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to put one past you. Don't give me too much credit, you know. No, no. Not at all. That's why. I'd like it if you would be my daughter's real boyfriend. Excuse me? Uh, <laughs> what did you just say? I think that's what he wants us to do. I ain't gonna do it. I said, won't you please ask my daughter out for real? Consider it, a mo it for a moment, please. Uh, what in the fresh hell makes you think that's a good idea? Because you're the ideal man. I think I can safely entrust her future to you. Whoa, slow down, bud. I'm having trouble leaving my ears. You could start by just pretending. That's fine. Heck, if she won't take you, I will. Uh, did you say what I think you did? Yeah, Dad. What's this all about? Give me a break, you two. This is where I'm this is why I'm single. <laughs> nice. Cool. That that was fun. Alright. Uh oh yeah, I've I've watched a bunch of Fall Guys. Whoa, I Haneda. Um. Oops, sorry. By this point, though, I've gotten kind of bored of it. I, I was watching uh, gameplay of it like the first beta that they had it weeks ago. So, but yeah, seems fun. What nani? All right, peeps. That's actually gonna wrap things up here for the night. Um. My voice is kind of shot. <laughs> um, There's a lot of reading in this game. It's kind of like Danganronpa in that sense where it's just a lot of, a lot of reading. Um, but yeah, that's going to wrap things up here. I hope you all have enjoyed. Thank you so much for hanging out as per the usual. Y'alls are awesome. Um, I don't know if I'll be back this weekend, but uh, yeah, keep an eye out in case if uh, you're around and want to hang out. Um, for anyone else out there who is new to the channel, you want to be informed of when I stream again, make sure to hit that follow button. I tend to stream on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, which hasn't been happening very often. I kind of stream whenever lately, but I try to stick to Monday, Wednesday, and Friday starting at 8 p.m. Eastern Time. We go until about 10 or 11. Uh, currently, we've been playing Yakuza 0. Eventually, I would like to get back to Fallout 2 and then move on to something else or just mi mix in something else as we're playing this as well. Um, but having 
a good time. And I hope you are too. And uh, I hope y'all have a nice night or day, depending on where you are. And hopefully, I'll see you next time. Peace.